Hundreds of industry experts, along with government and military leaders, gathered for two days on Solomon's Island for the annual Open Architecture Industry Day and FACE Consortium, sponsored by Navair's PMA 209. Day one of the two-part event kicked off with remarks from Executive Director Leslie Taylor. She says the program's participation is critical in raising awareness to show how open architecture can bring more speed to the fleet. Events like this allow a lot of practitioners in the open architecture field to come together and network and learn from each other and we'll see a great deal of exhibitions that show the art of the possible in terms of open architecture. Um, open architecture is relatively new to NAVAIR, but it's been ongoing in industry for quite a long time. So it's trying to show people what we have to offer, um, introduce them to the team within PMA 209 that can help them actually implement open architecture, uh, and show all the good products that are being developed by industry as well. Attendees got the chance to check out various technologies that promise to bring improvements to the tools of the warfighter. Companies like Boeing set up demonstrations to give folks a hands-on look at the future. Captain Chris McDowell, program manager for PMA 209, says the showcase is a win-win for the Navy and for the event's participants. Uh, the benefits to NOC AD are multifaceted. Uh, the shared understanding of where the technology uh, is to meet our open architecture uh, approaches and uh, solutions is of great benefit. Participants broke off into smaller working groups to discuss solutions for the fleet. From the broader scope of industry to a more focused approach on open architecture, day two opened up with words from Air 66 director Candy Chesser. She shared her hopes for the FACE consortium. It's very encouraging to see the level of participation has increased each year. And so um, I think the more membership we have, uh, it brings more value to the, uh, the validity of being able to adopt the standard that the group is uh, participating in creating and um, that standard way of operating as well as the level of understanding what industry expects, what the government expects, 